We're here at Hop Cart Indoor Go Kart Racing, you know, I always love it and uh, why not come out here? A bunch of the guys on the team think they're bad, you know, we're about to see, we're about to see that one of my manager actually thinks he's pretty badass and I don't, I don't think, look how long his v-neck is, that's not badass to me. <laughs> What's the cart like, man? Well, I, I grew up on Mario Kart, Mario Kart and Tupac. That's how I made it out of Hawaii. Red shells and dog legs. Hmm. What does the winner win besides pride? We need something else on the table here. You wearing a sunga on the beach. Oh, there you go. Best time gets to choose who they wanted the sunga to be on. Oh, oh. Raja. How's that, right? Done. Best time gets to choose the sunga walking on the beach. And oh, <laughs> They know I was the best guy in Dan there, so they're blocking me in. <laughs> and they, they, I always give my manager shit, so you gotta let him win in something, you know? I just like no who's gonna wear a gold in Sungas. Is it really a fucking secret? <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be me, guys. Oh, big surprise, Brian one, it's gonna be me. <laughs> I don't even know what a golden Zunga is, or Zumba? Zunga. Zunga. Okay, I guess it's a... I don't know if I can do that to Max, Max. I'll do it to you, though. <laughs> A felicidade sempre grande, né, cara? Você tá lutando, você tá é, fazendo aquilo que você gosta, né? Eu acho que, que chega um certo momento da sua carreira que é, é, você tem que... Eu sente prazer eu sair. Então, onde eu sinto muito prazer de estar aqui. Eu acho que você chegar a ser o campeão é muito difícil. Mas você se manter o campeão é maior ainda. Um dia eu sonhei ser o campeão e virei o campeão. E nem por isso é, me senti numa zona de conforto. Acho que a energia é muito boa, acho que todo mundo é, fica ali na energia positiva. Então eu fico muito feliz e bem tranquilo quanto isso, né? Acho que não pode vir quem vir aqui, que toda vez que eu lutar no Rio, a vitória sempre é nossa. Toda vez que eu entro no cage, eu sempre estou feliz, né? Foi isso que eu escolhi para minha vida, foi isso que, que... É isso que eu sei fazer, então eu sempre vou estar bem com fome de vitória. I feel something's steering me in this camp, and I feel like let's let's do it again. Let's let's make another journey. I came in a stage of my life that fighting for me is a pleasure. So it's great, and and be able to be here and perform in front of this amazing fan. So I'm I'm very content. Sit, sit pretty, sit pretty. What's that? Uh, Japanese stuff. It's like green. It looks like pistachio ice cream. Wasabi. Oh, how much it touched you. Nate, Nate's low level jokes are getting really good. You can never forget that. That's a gem. I'm starting to see his setups too. I'm starting to see the faces he makes right before the setup. The real serious thing. Even in my offense, you make me lose my balance. Yeah. And it's solely just from doing your defense. And then, and then your attack comes into play, you know? That's good. You gotta come ready, guys. You ever wondered, oh man, I need a fork. Oh man, I need a spoon. Damn it, I need a knife. Guess what? I got all three in one of them. Spork knife. Sporks. Look at this, look at this, look. I'm cutting my banana with this spork. It's not gonna be a secret anymore, but... Canela, this shit is amazing. Hey, if you don't know what canela is, stop playing yourself. You better ask somebody. To be in another country, sometimes, you know, it's a little difficult. You know, it's just kind of a lot easier to get raw ingredients and be able to control what we are able to put in masks, even nutritious food, and, you know, it's, it's just simple, really easy. It's way more easy uh, on me, you know. It's uh, I know what I'm getting, I know what I'm putting in my, my body, and um, after training, I gotta wait for room service or something. No, I got this man, I'm like, hey, can you whip me something to eat real fast? And, you know, get it done, get out the way, and bada boom, bada bang. Dá uma corridinha legal aqui, ver umas pessoas, 
Isso é bom. Vou lutar com Ian Medeiros. Nós passamos esses, esses últimos meses aí estudando bastante, vendo várias lutas dele. Valeu, obrigado. Eu estou preparado. Na minha cabeça eu já sei exatamente assim, é, o que é. ele vai fazer na luta. Ah, eu quero ver no corte de primeira. Ah, boa. Aí. Ah. Segundo 3 de junho, vitória, com certeza. Acho que eu vou pedir um hamburgão. Hands on by your waist? You know, every time in Hawaii, when we go to other people's friends' houses or family houses, we always bring something to the house. You know, it's just a good gesture. And me and Max, you know, we try and bring that Hawaii or that Aloha spirit everywhere we go. Just because that's just how we were raised. I mean, here's a little essence of Hawaii, no matter where we are. Just try and give everybody some chocolate. <laughs> I mean, I don't, I don't, I don't usually get people turn, turned out chocolate. <laughs> Good. And be like, why you look so mad in your pictures? And nah, I'm tired. <laughs> so I ain't ever mad. Me considero pioneira quando eu comecei. Só tinha uma menina junto comigo no tatame. E eu fico muito feliz com a evolução do MMA feminino, porque todo mundo falava ah, o MMA feminino não tem futuro, mas na minha cabeça eu estava fazendo as mesmas coisas que os, os homens estavam fazendo. Então por que, que eu não ia chegar lá? Esse chocolate aqui o Yancy Medeiros me deu porque ele me viu triste, porque eu não dormi. <risos> eu vou comer depois da luta. <risos> Uh, in my mind, my biggest challenge, don't eat brownie. <laughs> This is my biggest challenge. But after a fight, uh, I, will, I eat everything and I will be very fat, but very happy. I don't need motivation. I love MMA, I love UFC, I love, I love my job. When I think about this fight, uh, I see my hands up. Now we train only speed, uh, quick session, 25 minutes. All the fight I must be very quick, very, very dynamic, very strong <laughs> to beat Claudia. Another hard day in office. <laughs>